long as we don't have any misfires with the timer. All right, we are gaming. Cozy check. There we go. Shout outs to the wolves. Oh, a little late, didn't get the elbow. A one, a two, doink. The fish. Probably gonna take me a small amount of time to get back into the zone. Uh, the trick, the probably one of the biggest tricks here is just properly switching uh, control schemes between games. It's going to be one of the hardest things to do. Mostly just Monkey Island 1 and percent. It, it looks like that when you first start out. It definitely does. Now put on your helmet. Oh. Yeah, things do take off once we uh, get to Monkey Island. Which Fettuccine brother are you? That's a good question. Uh, what are their names? I'm gonna try to actually kind of cut that corner nice and tight. There we go. I don't remember their names off the top of my head. Okay, we're gonna go take a trip down to the jail cell and skip and then we're out of there there we go no shopkeeper I guess we got to throw throw one in there huh don't we that's the rule okay no credit early imagine though Got our shopping done. Oop, I tried to do a little extra fancy movement, and uh, well, it didn't quite work out. A little bit of a movement there. How's everybody doing today? Open the door. There we go. Okay, got in with no issues. There's a weird thing if you're oddly late on skipping that cutscene there. Bill Fettuccini, then the Alfredo Fettuccini. I'm probably more of an Alfredo myself. Which one? Wait, which one? Okay, chat. I need some assistance here. Which Fettuccini bro is voiced by which voice actor in the special edition? That is going to make all the difference. The dogs are fine. They're just sleeping. I'm going to go in here. I'm actually going to do a non-standard movement to the middle of the room there before jumping into the gaping hole. Escape. Skip, 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 skip. Click. There we go. 
open the door, skip, pick this up. Okay, looking at my pace now, I can see there were a little behind. Rob Paulson's Alfredo? Okay. Who was the other one? Is it Jess Harnell? Oh, I wasn't shooting there. Uh, that's fine. Sword fighting time. Sword fighting time. I know, uh, more recently, Monkey Island fans will know Jess Harnell as the uh, voice of LeChuck for Return to Monkey Island, but some people may not know is that he also did some voices in the special editions, and I think some of the other ones as well. Some other voices, maybe in four, maybe in... I think it's like one, two, and four. Um, looking like a treasure, treasure early. Let's do a little glitch here. Oh, I was late on it, but it'll have to do. gonna turn okay we're gonna wait for the pirates to turn um, okay I gotta focus here for a second somebody else will be suited to answer your question but it is a good question okay we're gonna take that extra multis that I don't want at the moment. I'm looking for a specific insult or a, a small selection of ah! That was one. Alright. This is rather bad luck. There we go. Oh, okay. Whew. I saved just in time. Something weird with my save timing there. There we go. Let me through. What did I get? Um, this one? Okay, we got it. Now I just need a rebound here. I can answer questions and stuff once we get past sword fighting. This takes most of my brain power. What did I have? Hemorrhoids. This is one of those speedrunner sentences. There we go. One more fight, and this one we can just win, win out. Our first two fights went well. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we're going to run back into the woods. Oop, can you go through there, please? I think Omesta answered the question nicely. Okay, 
So going against Carla here, we have very little in the way of responses to you. So we need to save low to find the ones that we do have answers to. Okay. Uh, the correct answer to that question is Morgan Le Fay. Le Flay, excuse me. For that uh, one specifically, I'd say Elaine. Okay, I'm looking for one more. Uh, where is it? That one. Really bad. Uh, Fury, I know you're uh, new to the stream. Welcome in. But I'm going to have to ask you to watch the language. Thank you. This is a PG stream. Family friendly. One, two, four, five. Thank you very much. From the Monkey Island YouTube video? Does that mean the one short eye Monkey Island video? Oh, I, I clicked outside the window. Whoops. All right, back on. We're back on track. We're back on track. We're past the insult sword fighting. That is the uh, most brain intensive part of the speed run. We're going to do an early mug transfer there. Uh, so we, we're just carrying one mug with us. Ah, oh, yes, the Sierra Games. That's that uh, one short eye bread and butter, if you will. Okay, there we go. We got Otis. So we passed the three trials. So now we're trying to get a crew and a ship together. There we go. And skip. So now we need to get a, a note of credit. Um, hold on. Let's see. Oh, that was... I hit... I hit a wrong button. I hit a wrong button. something up four three four I think I need to reset this okay one two three four Goodness, that was almost as slow as it could have been. Guybrush, what are you doing? I was, was I anti moving there. Yes, I'm, uh, I can add to the fact that, uh, yes, One Short Eye does great work. I'm trying, I'm trying to read this, uh, this copy pasta thingy here. It's very good. Main game is RuneScape. Oh, okay, very cool. Oh, that's the wrong button. There we go. That 
That is a good point. Uh, actually, I th I was wondering about this. I think the Monkey Island one guide is not properly linked on SRC. Somebody might need to poke Leo to get that linked in the guides. But yes, it should be more or less up to date. Here's a, a neat little trick. Uh, give. If you give the note to Carla, it saves you a bit of time instead of t just talking to Carla to convince her to join your crew. Let's do that. Anyways. Oh, yeah, that's uh, got some anti movement there. Okay, now we're going to go talk to Stan. Now, Stan, this Stan bit is interesting. Let's see. Something I didn't realize until I was looking into it recently. So there's actually three different methods to get Stan to lower the price. Two. finish that thought in a second um, as it turns out the two we use are the walk away technique the uh, haggling with the extras and the what's the other one and the lowballing offers as well. They also like all have different values associated with them. It's very interesting. Anyways, it's funny. You don't actually have to haggle all the way down to 5,000 to get Stan to accept the offer of 5,000. It's just anything below 7 works. skip could happen that's right I do need to update that don't I do this I did that kind of not how I wanted to but it's fine there we go. one soup coming up pick up the pot Gotta pick up the rope now. Wait to pick up the rope now just so that uh, all three of the ingredients we need to activate the cannon are right next to each other. And here we are. Gunpowder, rope. Fun fact, if you just use the pot, Guybrush lights the cannon automatically. Okay, folks, we're almost, almost one, one sixth of the way there so to speak. So I need this, and I need this. Oh, I, I did a click where I shouldn't have clicked. Okay, I'm going to safety save in case I mess this up. And there's a little slide there. Okay. Uh, so now we're done with Monkey Island 1. There it was. Did you see it? Guybrush goes into his crouched down uh, animation there while moving. There it was. A lot of speedrunning strats are discovered by new casual playthroughs, so anything's possible. That definitely happened in... Uh, for Monkey Island 2 for a while. Yeah, unfortunately, that strat got, um, or excuse me, that, I should say, has happened multiple times in Monkey 2, but I remember one in particular was a fun find. Um, the, the, the horn strats, basically, which we can get to at some point today, I think, if you stick with us. Good sixth yeah, so, 
Moving on. There's a, a new skip that came out from a uh, casual playthrough. Um, I'm now realizing I... Th Does the slide work in Amiga? Oh, wait, hold on. Uh, do we YOLO or do we play it safe and go FM Towns? Because, okay, fun fact, the Amiga route for part one, okay, play it safe. I mean, if the if the slide exists, okay. If it doesn't work, the backup th there's a backup. We're gonna go Amiga. We're gonna go Amiga. Um, because if the one I'm thinking of doesn't work, there's a backup. So we'll be fine. And a three, and a two, and a one, and a go. Go, there we go. First input didn't take there. Oh, hold on. Um, we're just, I'm gonna eat the time loss. First. Oh, I hear noises. Yo, the prime game is up. Sorry, we had a little bit of a cacophony there. Rabbit, come on. I'm getting a bad Wally here. A tw Yeah, this is this is old school for sure. Um, for a long time, it was believed that uh, playing the specifically Amiga port of Monkey Two was the fastest. here there we go we're gonna grab the knife and then we're actually gonna leave yeah oh pick it up got ready to do my next move in a little bit too quickly Yeah, Mike, the viewers have been doing some Monkey 2 runs lately. Uh, I'm going to grab the mud now. And we're actually going to take a trip on the coffin. Part of the reason we do this is because look how fast the coffin moves on Amiga. Look at this. Oh, I think we're in an ad break. I'm going to come grab a string. good bum, bum. Oh, just, just some schmoobin I'm supposed to be doing here I'm getting distracted that's okay skip come here let's take some try to get the bucket on there quickly Okay, so you'll notice I have all three ingredients I need to uh, trap the rat in the box. Watch this, we're gonna clip this corner. Nice. Stick in the box, cheese in the box. A string on the stick. There is a slightly faster way to order my inputs there. All right, I think we're I think we are now through the ad break. Welcome back.
So I have my laundry ticket here. Oh, I'm not paying attention. I missed the corner skip. I'll give this to this guy. And then look at that rat in the box. Excuse me? Pick up the rat, please, sir. So if you count it, we have currently two out of four ingredients for the voodoo doll. So we're going to do this. Then we're going to come over here. Talk to this guy. Get the spit. We're gonna talk to him again. Get the cook fired. Take his job. Take his money. Okay, so now we have, so count up, three out of four voodoo. Welcome in, Raiders. How's it going, everybody? What were you playing today on stream, Lemming? Monkeys? Multiple, yes. This is the infamous slide percent. Return to Crondor. Ah, that name sounds familiar. I am gonna go ahead and skip the jar. We're not going to need it. Come on. Skip. Didn't want to skip. Okay. We're turning in all the ingredients for the voodoo doll here. So I think I, I started this out and never finished it. Uh, instead of speed ring in silence because we turn the music off to gain speed I just throw on a playlist of video game music instead glitch hunt yeah I would not be surprised at all if there's still oops tricks to be found Based actions. I didn't do the thing. It's fine. I'll make it work. Cut the corner here. There we go. Nice. There it is. Uh, I just need to go to Booty Island. If this works like I think it is going to work. In fact, I'm going to make my safety safe here. Okay. There it was. You all saw it. Uh. Okay. There it was. I, I thought it was early. I must have been just right on the frame there. Cool. Yeah, so for whatever reason, as you close the coffin there, if you input a movement command, there it might be one or two frames window there that you have to do it. Uh, but Guybrush will do a little slide. I saw it. It's quick. It's quick. It's there. We'll, we'll you know what? That's the, you know, we'll, we'll check the tapes afterwards, but I'm pretty sure that was it. Um, now we get to, I'm gonna do a little Curse of Monkey Island. Uh, 
so if you're interested to see any amount of this, hold on. Sorry, 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 sorry. Okay, sorry. We were getting double music there. I fixed it. Uh, don't, don't blink. Here comes three, two, one. Slide time. All right, uh, and we're done with that. Um, in fact, scurvy dogs. yeah, done in record time. Okay, now we're gonna change. <laughs> Is that world record pace for sliding? Sure. <laughs> um, so fun fact: the slidey's game gets so little time to slide. I know. Um, I have set up a auto hotkey script just to be clear to rebind my keys here because I was getting sick and tired of uh, rebinding keys. Okay, escape from Monkey Island. Here's another one. Blink and you'll miss it. Okay, so here we go. Three, two, one. I broke the game. I think I, okay. I think I remember what's going on here. Let me try this again. Ah, <laughs> oh, this was happening in my testing. How did I fix it? Shoot. I I did I I was doing it earlier and by earlier I mean yesterday. Okay. This is not going quite as fast as I was hoping it was going to go. <laughs> Let's try setting it to Wumbo. Um Is it the auto hotkey script that breaks it? Here. I think it does. It might? I don't know. <laughs> Sorry, I apologize I for misleading the audience. I'm not picking that up. Oh, uh, I'm trying to use the old hotkeys. It's too cumbersome to handle with just my feet. Oh, use? There we go. Son of a gun! Slide percent. I'm gonna figure it out. We're gonna have to... We're gonna, We're doing it live. Um, hang tight. I had this figured out at one point. All the auto hotkey script does is it rebinds my keys so I don't have to. <laughs> I will share the script even. But normally you have to like come in here and change your hotkeys every time. It does not save hotkeys between runs. It's a random stuff for me. I, I was playing, I did it before without this issue. This is ruin you're ruining everything, Escape from Monkey Island. <laughs> oh, I think I know what it is. I think I know what it is. Uh, it's going to take me a second to get back to the thing. I think I remember... See if this works. It's working. Okay, slide. It's it slid. Uh, 
Um, okay. What was the solution? I had to... So I was using... Okay. To get 1.0 to install, I had to use this special installer thing, right? And which comes with a special launcher thing. Uh, I just opened it up via the application. It did not give me the windowed mode or anything. There's a there's a way to do it though. Oh yeah, okay. So you're I'm what I'm supposed to do is just open up the application from a command prompt so I can get the dash gl dash w to play windowed mode. L launching from the launcher is what messes it up. Okay, that took that felt like it took forever, but we actually got through that in only a few minutes. Okay, in the future, that's supposed to happen like, boom, right there, the start of the game. Um, now we get to do another long one. In fact, I need to switch scenes over here. Telltale Games. Uh... That is four out of six slides. Very good. Um, why is my game, like, not loading? There it goes. Okay. That was scaring me. Um, also, before I get started, I need to pull up my notes, because I will forget... How to speedrun this chapter. Okay, so timing starts on first input. So if I go here, we have a load pre, pre ready to go. Yeah, oh, best to try launching just the main executable from a command prompt. Try that. Um, okay, so here we go. In three, two, one, go. Escape is an underrated speed game, in my opinion. Do the, do the input there, like I want you to, game. Uh, yeah, it, not only the art style, but how one needs to actually uh, physically play them via the control schemes are all di very different. Chuck. A slice. One. A two. A buckle my shoe. It was not an auto hotkey issue. For the, uh, grab the item out of the inventory, please. Thank you. It's just Escape from Monkey Island is the hardest game to get running if you're not using like Steam or GOG have each I think have their own way to make it run. There's like other things you could do, Scum VM or Dream or emulators you can use. But if you're trying to just like get the game to run natively, that's a, a different trick altogether. Okay, we get a little break here.
Now, if somebody's interested in looking for tech, I know for a fact there is a way. I, I'm in my testing on Wednesday. I actually managed to get it one time off stream. There's a much faster way to get a guaranteed slide. Or I say guaranteed. A much faster way to get a slide in Tails than what I'm currently going to go for. I, I've only know one way to get the guaranteed slide. And that's like a bit later in. I know when the Woofs did this, there was a, a slide that happened that, looking at the tapes, it looked legit. It probably would be worth reinvestigating the tapes if the Woofs ever submitted it to verify its authenticity. But got one much earlier than what I'm going to go for here today. But I have managed to get a different slide entirely that would actually be quite fast. Is slide a real category? It's a meme category for sure. Although it it currently we haven't submitted it or not submitted but just made it an official category it is going to be How do I know this? Well, I'm I'm the mod. I make the rules, so we're going to make a category for it. Dioro here. Hi. Santa, what is up? Welcome to the stream. Map. Look behind you. Okay, can grab this. Then we're gonna take a little trek through the woods. this go here grab some bombs because Guybrush is a big fan of the Legend of Zelda go here I'm reading my notes to remember how to get through the jungle properly this looks, this looks promising north this looks west Unlock that. Here, let me try one time. Okay, I didn't get the slide. It was a time loss. There's a way to go through this side entrance to the town here and make a slide happen. I've done it, but I have no idea how to replicate it. That would be much faster than what we're going to do. So just imagine if I got in a slide there. And then compare that to how much more of the chapter we're going to be playing here. Go over here. Grab the bomb. you classify it as a slide as long as Guybrush isn't in a walking animation and is moving I think that is what we classify as a slide the one that you can get there that I was describing is extremely obvious in fact there is a clip I have from the stream where I first saw it oh I gotta grab this first if somebody wants to pull up the clip it, I think the clip is titled Alphabet Sale. It's a little, the tiniest bit of RNG there. Although, hey. for this run, actually, we skipped the YouTube, so it doesn't matter. The clip is called, I think it's called Ultimate Monkey Island. Clips by Archie. The 
sled sequence in King's Quest V. I'm not familiar enough with King's Quest V to comment on that, but yes, sure. Whatever that means. Combine these two together. Make our Dark Ninja Dave. Okay. Any news? Any news? Okay, so we're going to go here. This is that location we unlocked earlier. Dark Ninja, Dark Ninja Dave. Can we go back to the jungle entrance, go here. And Dioro the map. So coming up, we have to, we'll have to look closely to see if we get it. But it's the spot where the wolves seems to have gotten a slide. So watch. Sometimes you get these little jerky movements. You enter certain screens here. But... It was determined that those don't count. However, this one coming up, I think here, almost looks slidey. Oh, I got a weird thing there. If somebody wants to clip that and check. Otherwise, we will keep going. Character's animation was backwards. Yeah, Tails of Monkey Island. There's some questionable movements here. They require closer inspection to determine if they are actually slides. Do you have a no Where can I have never So shout outs to the voodoo lady. So I need this. No. No. It's me, Kyber Threepwood, Mighty Pirate. Anything? Yeah, that and that's just it. Just happens. I don't know why it does a weird little stutter. To me, it, it's almost as if it's like a uh, like a skid animation like a part of a turnaround animation or something I think this is where we just go and do this bit if I clicked on the flowers hopefully yeah I think in my practice I was doing this in a slightly different order which I don't know how much it matters but we're gonna do it in this order today so there we go so okay this is a bit of a slow section by which I should just say it's 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 kind of a it's the pace, just as you're playing through the speed run, feels a bit different. What? A better. And uh, these also don't qualify. This this movement here doesn't qualify as a slide. Ding. Long. This looks like there we go.
Ding. Okay, one more. One more zap. There we go. Get the key. Wow, and a look. Wow. Go up. Okay, almost out of the chair. Last banana. Got it. Gotcha. That's what he says. Okay, let's see. So we're gonna go do. Well, I think the notes do say to do it in the different order. Doesn't matter that much. Oh, oh, here we are. Uh, I need to this one. This dialogue. Because we're skipping one of the this uh, the route for this bit of slide percent is fairly close to just what we do in any percent with a couple little skips and obviously we don't play the whole thing. Okay, so we do that. Then I'm gonna go over here, jump up. Hey Sam, hey Nurzy boy. Can you do the thing? And grab the grab the cheese. Grab the cheese. I don't know why I was being weird there. Hey. Fire the cannon. This gets the glass floor guy to leave this horn here for us. So we can take it with us. There it is. And we're gonna go over here. We're gonna talk to this pirate. This for later. This is gonna help us to slide. And then I do this with this. Toot toot! our way through the jungle again so this is like here A little dance and then it is sorry Finding my spot, lost my spot in the notes. Okay, so yes. Far, so this way. Okay, I think we're back from the ad break. Ah, uh, yes, that's where we do this. East. Weast. We're in a different spot. We'll go here. We made it through. Cat's astrological sign. How interesting. By interesting, I mean... I've not seen that ad before. Just 
stick the pyrite parrot in there to uh, trick the singed and to open it for us. Me, Guybrush Three Boy, mighty pirate. I do kind of appreciate that, uh, despite the fact that we skip most dialogue. We cannot skip that one in particular. him to come out over here. Okay, we're almost there. I can't. This... Well played, Monsieur. That's a well played, Monsieur Stripid. Close. Not there yet. But I do believe there's probably a faster way. What well, I know there's faster slides, but this specifically, this one is. I do believe I need to do this one. No slide yet. It's coming. I'm actually going to safety save here. Just in case it breaks. where I'm going to safety save. Slot 8. Game saved. Let me back in. Okay, I do believe I found a small piece of the route that I can skip. By going over to here. Slames, welcome to the stream. I'm going here and doing the cheese second. The cheese is one three three. I didn't. One, two, three. One, two, three. You should get a slide here. Please show me the slide. Show me slide. There it is. That is one. Bonafide slide. Oh, Alright, and we are going to keep things moving along. Okay. I'm going to pull up the next game. Actually, I need to. Uh, it's probably not even worth my time to plug in the controller for this. Uh, where is the game? Switch the scene over play this game in a like very widescreen format it's in a cutscene no it counts You know what? I do need the controller for some of these, uh, how the hotkeys are set up. And I didn't, I missed, started the timer anyways. So you know what I'm going to do? We're going to plug in the controller and start again.
it's still based on actions we do. You can... Why is my webcam slid down there? If you do things in a certain way, um, it won't slide there. So it still requires player input. Uh, let's try this. It's one of these buttons. There we go. Um, all right, let me just go back to normal. Get in there. Thing, grab the thing. There we go. Final slide. This one comes in pretty, pretty quick. Get in the door, please. To be fair. Like, the distance in time between two and three coming out was, what, six years? Then it was another three years for Escape from Makya, the fourth one. And then it was another nine or ten years. And then after that, it was another something crazy uh, from 2009 to 20... What? 13 or no excuse me 2023 or was it 2022 like another what 12 13 years or something let's see favorite art style Probably two, yeah. Two's pretty darn good. Although I do appreciate three. The more cartoony, hand-drawn style. Uh, is the wrong button? goal here is we gotta get this cutscene to trigger and then we gotta get into the voodoo lady shop and then we're basically there all right despite our setbacks it's looking like we will uh come in nicely under the one hour mark Two and three, I think, are definitely the best in terms of art style. Although I, I'll, I do think this one is pretty quick. Watch carefully. Slide. There it is. It's a, it's quick, but boom, that's time. We did it. We made a slide happen in all six Monkey Island games. Sub one hour, and this is with uh, escape not functioning properly. <laughs> <laughs> 